Hey everyone, this is Alone and I'm back with another episode of Stains Gate. But before I do talk about that and possible spoilers, here is a little artist promotion. Please be sure to check out the artist. Links is in the description box below where you also will find links to reaction video. And this episode of freaking Stains Gate. Why? Why? That, that is the entire feeling I have from this episode. I mean, this is screwed up my feelings so much. I mean, I was happy that. Wait, I, I actually managed pretty much just before. Uh, the um, the revelation I actually managed to guess who the father was that it was Daru and I was like oh yeah she got to meet her father even if it's a, a bit awkward probably I mean for him I mean wow uh, I get this daughter that went back in time but it all made sense and See, I was, I mean, that, that was a love, I love that, that made me so happy. And then, Sousa go freaking back in time, and it doesn't work, it's screwed, it doesn't happen, it's just uh, taking a piss on my emotions, this fucking show. I mean, that, that actually did hurt me a lot, definitely it did. I mean, it's it that is part of the twisted and complicated idea of time and time paradoxes and changing how things is. I mean, time is is of from what, what I remember reading back in the back in the days, long time ago, is that time is the only force that exists. That, that only moves in one direction and it's forward. There is no chance for time to go backwards. Obviously, if you don't have time machines like this and... Still, this is... I love the idea of this show, what they have done and... Uh, all the characters... And it, it, the entire thing is so hard to grip. It hurts. It freaking hurts so much right now. I really, ho I I really hope Susa somehow will come back and it will work out. I will, I will, I will, I will. That is one of my weaknesses is that I want everyone to be happy, and that is how I am in real life as well. I want people to be happy. I want all of you to be happy. I want. My family, my friends, and everyone around me at work. I mean, I spent about two hours today at work uh, putting up Christmas decoration because I wanted it to be nice and festive and generally just a nice feeling for everyone at, that is working there. When they start tomorrow, well, I, well, it's Wednesday now when you're seeing this, but I recorded this on Sunday. And seeing things like this... It's 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 it hits me so insane hard. Even more that she can't change. I mean, she did. It didn't change. It didn't work out for her. Everything just got screwed, and and she 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 paid like the ultimate price for. It. I mean, going back in time, losing her memory. She just wanted to see her father. I mean, that is like, yeah, damn it. Well, that is one thing that is sure that this show is good. They have done very well, insane, with making these characters so strong and the feeling to this. This is so beautiful and painful at the same time. Oh my gosh. I'm 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 actually starting to fear to watch more of this because 
things are getting very twisted. And uh, now we just... The question is if Majora will survive or she will die or how it will go. <sighs> My god. Uh, I'm, <laughs> I'm angry, angry and sad right now. That is, this is... God damn it. Ah, well, I will be back with another episode of Stains Gate very soon, of course. So thank everyone for watching so far. Remember to comment, share, subscribe, and like for more. It means super much to me. And I will be back soon with more anime, more reactions, more Let's Plays, and all that. So see you later on. And most of all, though, have a continued super great day.